Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with our last break of the night, maybe. Unless we do like a box of noir soccer, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Diamond Kings baseball. We filled it up. Pick your team eight on a Friday night. There's everyone right here. Thanks, everybody, for getting into the action. There we go. There we go. If there's if there's any raise hits, we'll randomize it to someone in the group. But I think there are they are few and far between. All right, so let's pop this case open. So I think if you remember the previous video, I marked the the inner cases L and R. So we did L yesterday, and that was break seven, and now we're doing R, the right side, today. It's a pirate break. R, right? No? Okay. It's Friday. It's Friday, losing my mind. All right. There it is. So four stacks of three will make 12, of course. There it is. We'll do a Michael Bay helicopter shot. Ready? Right? And I just need lens flare to make it all look cool. So there it is. There's your Michael Bay helicopter shot. All right, good luck, everybody. All right. Yeah, I need more explosions there in that Michael Bay shot. But not on the stuff, though, obviously. All right, folks. So if you're if you've been following along all evening, that Baltimore Braves game, the the Baltimore at Atlanta game is not over yet. It might be though. Top of the fifteenth, the Orioles have scored three runs in the top of the fifteenth to take a ten seven lead. Now the Braves had tons of chances to win this game, but but nothing, but nothing. And if you've been following along, you know that I had. I had a penny or two on this game. I had the Braves to win. They were heavy favorites too. Maybe a little too heavy. Maybe that was my mistake. Maybe that was the the square the square bet. So I finally got three outs. So now it's up to I don't know who it's up to. I don't know who's coming up to bat. We'll find out in a second. And there you go. Lee, who has uh, Regicidal, has um, has the Mets his Mets in this one. Sad times for him too. He had uh, he had Mike Trout and beat the streak. Or he, had, he doubled down. He had Altuve and Trout. Altuve got a hit, um, and he just needed to get Mike Trout to get a hit, but he went over. And then Ian Kinsler grounded out just before Trout was coming up to bat to finish off the game. So sad times for him. And the Padres scored runs, and he lost out on a Brad Hand save. All right, so we'll save these. I think those are variations. We'll breeze through these. Commons don't ship, but inserts like that will ship. And obviously hits ship, like this Garrett Cole, Pittsburgh edition. I told it, it was case R. Pirates on the board early with Garrett Cole, dual relic and autograph. Although I'm not sure if Steel Curtain Michael Gallucci wants this one. Might be too painful. We'll save these Otanis, of course. Like that one as well. Who has the Angels in this one? EA with the Angels. Uh, you know what? If I find one, if I see one, I'll pull one out. Yankees, Mark Glassman, Angels, EA. That'll be a randomizer. That will not be a randomizer. That'll just straight up ship. So what am I going to do with these? I'll just leave these up. We'll top load these before they get shipped out, obviously, Eric, as you know. This will sleeve up because it's, it'll stay out on the table for a little bit.
George Brett portrait. That looks like, yeah, that's numbered. 15 out of 25. Nice. Out of 25s will sleeve up right away. That's for the Royals. That's for the X-Line. Paul Harris has an easy, an easy request for me. He's saying, just a Brian Anderson auto. That's it. I, I feel like I could accommodate that. Victor Robles. What about Chris Flex? No, you're going to get That's a rookie anyway. You're going to get that. Madison Bumgarner. You'll get this. And Anthony will get the Max Scherzer dual relic. DK material. Where did I get this Sharpie mark on here? Maybe from a NT break, I think. Save these variations over here. All right, next box. Oh, I see. It looks like the Braves are going to tease me, ladies and gentlemen. Bottom of the 15th. Leadoff walk being given up by Mike Wright Jr. Oh, man, what if the Braves tie this up and then, and then it just keeps going? I wonder is anybody is anybody watching this game? Is this on TV somewhere? Anybody out in Atlanta actually watching this game, listening right now? Are there is there anybody in the stands? I guess it's a Friday night. One a.m. though. One a.m. on a Friday night. I'll bet anybody who was waiting probably left after. The Orioles scored three in the top of the 15th. Oh, this is going to be over fast. Danny Santana strikes out swing, and then NCRT grounds out. But moves John Camargo to second. There's Ozzy Albius, Ozzy Smith. Jim Bottomley, Red Frame, Otani. Let's play two, Ernie Banks. And Willie Calhoun, former Dodger prospect, going to the Rangers, which was a great move for him, I think. That's for Jerry, Jerry Burkett with that. The reason why it's a great move, because he can hit a ton, but if you, if you look closely, it doesn't show it. His hands are made of stone. <laughs> he can't field. They, they're trying him out at second base, and they're just like, yeah, it's not working. Harry Walker. Mitch Graver. That's pitching Otani now. A lot of different variations for Shohei Otani. All of those add up, of course, value-wise, secondary market-wise. There's Ben Intendi, Sepia. It looks like that Braves game is mercifully over. 20 out of 25, Tyler Wade. Tyler Wade for the Yankees. That goes to Boombox. All right, so I, I went 3-3 three and three on my picks today. Maybe tomorrow's picks will be better, I hope. Today was a lot better. A lot, a lot, a lot better than the last couple nights, last few nights. Been terrible. Slowly back on track. All right, Actually, that's the wrong sleeve for this size card. Maybe we'll sleeve that later. Sleeve over here. All right, next box.
Rory typing Noir Soccer in the chat in all caps. My assumption is, is that Rory is implying that he'd like to join that break, have other people join the break. Not sure what that not sure what that means. There's no punctuation to let me know what it is. Maybe an exclamation point? He's just yelling at someone. Rory just walked into the room and yelled noir soccer, and then that was it. We could do noir soccer at the end, folks. Won't take too many people to fill. A random number break. We haven't seen noir soccer in ages. Scratch that soccer itch. All right. There's Bryce Harper. Pee Wee Reese. Old Dodger. Ted Williams. Not sure why that was flipped that way. We'll set that aside. And Chris Flexen. Oh, that's a nice patch. Look at that. Three out of 15. That's for Lee. Regicidal and his Mets. This guy any good? What's his, what's his deal? Jose Ramirez. Otani. Ted Williams, red frame. Francisco Mejia, black and white. Moro Tani, hitting edition. And Aaron Judge, dual relic for the Yankees. All right, so Lee saying he's all right. Nothing special yet, though. Young. Oh, Bellinger hit a grand slam? I, didn't, I actually didn't see... Look at the highlights of that. Ernie Banks, let's play two. Eddie Matthews, the 500. Richard Urania. More Otani, a couple more Otani. Gallery of Stars Otani and Artist Proof Otani. All that adds up. And the uh, and it's EA, Eric, who has the Angels in this one. Have we seen an Otani autograph out of Diamond King? I, I don't. I honestly don't remember. We've done a number of these, but I feel maybe one. All right, next box. Well, are, are all the games final? I think all the games are final now, right? In baseball? Baseball? That looks like it. Padres beating the Giants 6-2. Angels holding on to a 2-1 victory. Rockies pounding on the Marlins 11-3. Rangers over the Twins in Minnesota 8-1. Brew Crew were being shut out through six and one third. And then two solo shots later by Jesus Aguilar. Brewers win in Milwaukee, two to one. Kansas City holding on to a one nothing shutout of the Astros in Houston. Rays beating the Yankees two one. In Tampa Bay, Dodgers beating the Mets five two. Kershaw coming back tomorrow, from what I hear. And the Tribe shutting out the Tigers 10-0 in Cleveland. We'll get to the rest of the scores in the next box. Stay tuned. All right, next box. Justin Verlander. Evan Longoria. Still looks weird to me in a, uh, in a Giants uniform. 
couple Boston guys there. More Otani. Zach Granite, rookie signatures for the Twins. That'll be for Sanford and the Twins. Nice. Ted Williams, splendid splinter, nickname variation. Aurora Otani. Oh, do I ever remember Grover Alexander? I remember him, right? I remember watching old Grover Alexander. I don't. More Otani. And Joey Votto. Nice. 24 out of 49 original materials. For Scott V and the Red Legs. Francisco Mejia, gray frame. Black and white picture on the inside. And there's Mike Trout Sepia. And there you go. What's up, TJ? We have about two, we got eight boxes to go. So we're not that, not that far in. We're on minute, minute 18 of 50, 55. Uh, no, spoiler alert, TJ, no White Sox. You don't have to go back and watch the last 18 minutes. You've missed nothing. So TJ, as far as you're concerned, welcome to an eight-box pick-your-team break of Diamond Kings Baseball. Box number one. Harrison Bader. Yeah, um, Jose was also saying that the weather was kind of crazy in that neck of the woods. Jacoby Jones. Jacoby Jones playing baseball now. 41 out of 99 for Detroit. For the Tigres, Nick Barr. Otani Sepia. Pujols. Aurora, more Otani, and more Otani, Lucas Sims, Ahmed Rosario for the Metropolitans, and Leo DeRocher, 11 out of 25, nice DK materials. Bit of an old school dual relic for Mark Glassman and the Dodgers. Game used materials right there. There's Francisco Lindor. And the last bit right here.
the Ryan Express. And some Otanis. Oh, wow. Did Vince Scully pass away? Oh, Vinny Paul. I was just like, what? Pantera drummer. I was just like, what are you talking about? Although, he's been around. Vince scully has been around for a minute or two. Because I, then I saw TJ going, yeah, gone too soon. And I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I was like, I mean, I don't want Vince Scully to go. But I was just like, he has been around for a little while. But Vinny Paul Pantera drummer. <laughs> All right, next box. Good luck, everybody. Vin Scully, not dead. Vinnie Paul, rest in peace. Andy Garner piping in saying, local around your area will be missed. Yeah, Vin Scully, well... I don't know. I mean, I feel like Vince Scully's led a full life. You know what I mean? I mean, I want him around as long as possible, but but yeah. I mean, yeah. I remember. I was gonna say when Chick Hearn passed away. That was a pretty sad moment too. I feel like I feel like Chick Hearn and or Vince Scully. They should have got, gotten them to record, like the like the Metro stop. Like announcements, you know what I mean? I feel like they should they should have their voices recorded for that. There's Zach Granite. And Ozzy Albius for the Braves. Anthony Scrabble with that one. And then have a... Uh, I forget, why am I... I'm blanking on the... On the Spanish language announcer for the Dodgers, who's been there like just almost as long as Vince Scully has, and have him do the Spanish language versions of like Metro stop stations and whatnot, like next stop, whatever you know, Jose Ramirez. And some Brewers. There you go. Brad was like, come on, Brew Crew hit. And there it is. Two color, dual relic, and autograph. Brandon Woodruff. 284 out of 299. And Otani. Big hurt. Otani. Otani. 13 out of 99. Artist proof. Nice. Sepia. I feel like, do these still carry? I'm, I'm sure they do. I'm sure they still have a decent amount of value. All those add up. Francisco Lindor. That'll be another randomizer between the Angels and the Yankees. Yachty. Sam Crawford, Red Frame, and Kershaw. And those variations that I just picked up from right here will also have those sleeved and top loaded before they get sent out. 
All right, next box. Where did I where did I leave off on our live score updates? I think I left off with Cleveland shutting out the Tigers 10 nothing. I think the the Reds came back on the Cubs beat him 6-3 in Cincinnati. There was a slugfest in Boston. Did you guys hear about this? Slugfest in Boston with the Red Sox winning 14 to 10 over the Mariners. In our nation's capital, the Philadelphia Phillies went in there took the Nationals into the back and gave them a whooping, 12-2. In extra innings, Diamondbacks over the Pirates, 2-1. I don't think the first runs were scored until the 11th inning. White Sox over the Oakland A's, 6-4. In game one, game two of the doubleheader, 11-2 over the White Sox. So they split the doubleheader. And in 15 long innings in Atlanta, the Orioles finally scoring three runs at the top of the 15th. To beat the Braves. Braves had chances. They had chances. And Walker Bueller. Autograph. Nice. Rookie signatures. For Boombox. And the Dodgers, look at this, Mark. Take a little vacay from Jaspies. Comes back, hitting left and right. The future, right there. Way of the future. Walker Buehler's the way of the future. The way of the future. The way of the future. Way of the future. Way of the future. Rafael Devers, nice out of 25, 16 out of 25. Nice color in those patches. Red Sox, Jason, Jason H with that one. There you go, nice original materials. Jose Ramirez, gray frame. Otani, black and white. Otani hitting. Anyone have any updates on Otani? Or maybe maybe after they said they're shutting him down for a few weeks, then they'll check back later, I guess was the idea. I hope he doesn't have to get Tommy John. That'd be that'd be pretty terrible. A lot of people were concerned about what, what happened in the in the secondary market value, I think it'll certainly dip for a little bit, but it should should come back. It'll be no different than, you know, Dalvin Cook going down or Deshaun Watson going down. Their value took a little bit of a hit as well, but I think they'll they'll start creeping back once they're back into the public consciousness. They're playing again. I wonder if uh, I wonder if he's okay. I wonder if they'll just be like, "You're not gonna, you're not gonna pitch again this season." But if he's healthy enough to hit, maybe they'll continue having him do that in the DH spot or something. I could see that happening, or maybe just shut him down for the rest of the season. I guess. The worst case scenario. Is if he does get that Tommy John surgery, the problem is, is that it's June now, so he wouldn't if he got the surgery. Well, they're not going to find out until like July. So if he gets the surgery, it takes about a full calendar year. That's the following July, and by then, you know, you're kind of rehabbing your way back. So they're not going to have him, you know, throw eight innings a night or eight innings every every five days or whatever, five or six days, right away. So he won't put in that many starts next year. 
so we wouldn't see them until like 2020, like back in full form. But good news is, is that he is young. Bobby Thompson, stealing signs. Mickey Mantle, the Mick. Yeah, the gray frame is numbered. I did, did I not? I thought I sleeved that, didn't I? Did I not? No, I think I did. Yeah, that that'll get top loaded by the shipping crew before it gets shipped out. It's kind of a long break, so that's why I'm kind of breezing through it. We've got a nice Andrew Stevenson, eight out of fifteen. Nice low number for Anthony. And the Nats. Nice patches in there, too. Josh Bell. Joe Cronin, artist proof to 25. Otani. And Ty Cobb. Now the lower numbered ones I will top load immediately. I'm like out of 25 and under, I generally do. I think the gray frames are like out of 99, I think. That's a nice Otani too. Portraits. Those are shorter printed. Victor Robles. Juan Soto stealing Victor Robles' thunder. Victor Robles is supposed to break out this year. Jeff Bagwell, Jersey Kings. That's pretty cool. Astros, Jason. They are at 99. All right, believe it or not, we only have four boxes left. See what I see what I mean about this break feels a lot faster than it really is. Last four boxes, two hits per box. And a lot of short prints, a lot of different parallels, a lot of fun stuff like that. So hopefully we'll finish strong on this. All right. Well, what can we what can we look at? What's going on tomorrow? Baseball wise. Saturday, the 23rd for tomorrow. We got Mengden facing Covey in Chicago. Chicago White Sox. Is uh is Daniel Mangdon the one with the mustache? I also picked up Kobe on my fantasy team. And that's how desperate I need the pitching. Rangers are at uh, Minnesota. It's an early game too. Gallardo versus Odorizzi. Odorizzi three and four. The Twins were hoping for a little more from Odorizzi. Marlins are in Colorado. That's Richard Richards? I don't know who Richards is there. And then Tyler Anderson, maybe? These have last names. Um, and then Zach Granke facing Joe Musgrove in Pittsburgh. Oh, he does have the... There's Anthony Rizzo. Giancarlo Stanton, Yankees edition. Let's play two. Sure, Ernie. We'll do it. Let's play two. That goes to Cosmo and the Cubs. Ahmed Rosario, black and white for Lee and the Mets. Japanese Babe Ruth.
Dom DiMaggio, red frame. And Zach Granit. Dual relic and autograph for the Twins. 160 out of 299. Zach Granite. Not to be confused with Zach Marble. That goes to Sanford. Dad jokes. All right, three boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Did we have, was there just this one? Three boxes to go. We got Eric Lyles facing Suarez on the Giants. Wow, this is really test my, test my knowledge here. I don't know. What the Suarez? I can only think soccer right now. I can only think Luis Suarez. Eugenio Suarez? U is Eugenio Suarez on the Giants now? Anyway. Padres Giants. Exciting matchup there. Aaron Nola is facing Eric Fed. Dylan Bundy facing Julio Terran. I don't know who Farrell is for the Cubs, but that guy is facing Anthony Desclaf Desclafani. I got it. In Cincinnati, Sonny Gray facing Wilmer Font, former Dodger Wilmer Font, making the start. I think that's that's that must be the the bullpen day. Cardinals Brewers. We've got Mikolas. Oh, I'm forgetting his first. And then Anderson on the Brewers. Anderson. Tyler Anderson? No, that's Rockies. Brewers have an Anderson? They call him Tony Disco? Oh, man. That's that's pretty cool. I, I kind of love that. Uh, oh, Red's Eugenio Suarez is crushing it. I don't know who I don't know who the who the Suarez is for the Giants. Giants edition. Starting pitcher. All right. Otani. Sepia. Also, Lee, I've been looking for... I've actually been specifically looking to pull like a... DeGrom or Syndergaard base card. I feel like I have not seen one unless I missed it. I saw a couple inserts, but those are going to ship anyway. Chase Anderson, right. Zach Granite. Sanford, you're starting your Zach Granite PC, whether you like it or not. John McGraw, red frame. Otani. Laser show. Robles. Two color dual relic for the Nats. There you go. There's our two hits right there. Ryan McMahon, brown frame to 49. Mr. Brown frame, Mr. Brownstone. Should I put some Guns N' Roses on the on the next playlist? It's been a while since we've put some G and R. Yeah, okay. So you haven't seen one either. Yeah, I saw a Degrom insert back there, like early on. But I was like, yeah, I'll 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 pull one. I'll pull a a base card or two. Just just for S's and G's, and now it's just not even there. All right, well, maybe in the next two boxes. We've got two boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. We're almost done. Should be done in about about 10 minutes or so. Five minutes a box. And I think we're going to call it a night after that. I don't see any other orders coming in. Sorry, Rory, if you're still up. I don't think that noir soccer is going to happen. Uh, I have no idea if Zach Granite is good or not. 
If it wasn't for Diamond Kings, I don't think I'd, I'd even know if he existed. Lee's a big baseball guy. Lee, do you have any ideas? Zach Granite? Look at look on fa Fangraphs.com, Card Blasters. They usually do a pretty good job with with prospects. All right. Aaron Nola. Oh, we already, already went through those games. Is that Tigers Liriano? Is that Francisco Liriano? And I and I want to say Jake Bauer for the Indians, but that's not that's that's Ray's Jake Bauer, Trevor Trevor Bauer, <laughs> Ian Kennedy and Lance McCullers facing each other, Clayton Kershaw and Degrom. That's actually a nice matchup. Uh, Mike Leak and Eduardo Rodriguez, I believe, and Marcus Stroman is back. Old Marcus Stroman still on my DL. I'll I'll wait I'll wait a start to see what happens there. And uh, Jaime Berea, who actually kind of like got Jaime Berea on my fantasy team. And I got Jake Bowers. Added Jake Bowers to my fantasy team. Pee Wee Reese. Buster Posey Aurora. Otani. Springer, Red Frame. Brooks Robinson, it's boss man's favorite baseball player. I think TJ's favorite baseball player too of all time. Their personal favorites. And we've got a nice Ryan Healy. Seven out of fifteen for the Athletics. Darren Warwick on the board. Oh, and that Blue Jays Angels game, that's it. That was the last game of the of the Saturday slate. And a four out of five, Lloyd Wayner. For the Pirates, Michael Gallucci. Old school. All aboard. Whoop whoop. Um, I think his brother, yeah, Paul Wayner. The Wainer brothers. There's Altuve. There's artist proof George Kelly for the New York Giants. I'll go to San Francisco, of course, obviously. Orange. Oh, look at this. Brothers, brothers, brothers in baseball. Manny Machado. Where does he go? And there's Bellinger, Jersey Kings. Four out of 99. Hit a grand slam today, according to Jose. Boombox. All right, last box coming up. What would I give up? What would the Dodgers give up? I don't think the Dodgers will, will go for Manny Machado, but... Oh, I don't know if you heard earlier, Lee. What about what about Manny Machado to the and, and like Dylan Bundy to the Brewers? Is that crazy? Let's say the Brewers say F it, we, we're going all in. They need a starting pitcher. They could use starting pitching. They could use a, a bat in the lineup. Like Manny Machado's. Right, that's what I see. That's what I thought too. They have the prospects to do it, right? Corey Ray, Orlando Arcia. Hiruta, right? Would you would you move would you move the Haterade if you got like Zach Britton back? 
and Brad Brack, maybe. Let's say they let's say they gave up both for the Haterade. I think that actually might be I, that could be a really interesting deal. I don't know. I, I was listening to the Baseball Tonight podcast with Buster only, but I, I was I I agree. I think who was Keith Law or Jerry Krasnick was saying it. Um, but they're like every day that goes by. Nice Babe Ruth royalty. Actually, we don't. I don't think we see these too often. Um, I think each day that goes by, their their value is just the value of Machado is just like diminishing by by the day. Haters, their future ace. Rory seems to suggest. Rory's a big Brewers guy. He seems to suggest that. Uh, wow. Last box. Three out of 49, dual relic and autograph Shohei Otani for EA Sports. It's in the game. Well, that was unexpected. I was like breezing through this break, just shooting the breeze with Lee. And here this comes. Is, is Eric even still awake? Sometimes Eric half listens in the background. Wake up, Eric. There it is. We haven't seen we haven't seen his ink in a very very long time. In any in any baseball break. That's a nice way to end the night. It's out of 49. That's a pretty low number as far as Otani autographs go. J.D. Davis. Yeah, I smell clickbait too, Sanford. I'm definitely clickbaiting this video. 19 out of 49, Dustin Fowler. If, uh, <laughs> if, if Eric comes in the room tonight or tomorrow and he's just like, hey, any Angels hits? We should all just be like, we should all just make him watch the hour-long video. What is that? The 46-minute mark. We should make him watch it. I just gonna have to watch Eric. Uh, that goes to Darren. There's the Correa to 99 gray frame. It'd be worth it. I wouldn't mind making him do that. Lou Gehrig artist proof 10 out of 99. More Otani. Ryan McMahon red frame. Honestly, Lee, I honestly don't think we've seen any like normal commons of <laughs> Noah Syndergaard and Jacob DeGrom. There's like a million GD cards in this set. Well, there you have it, folks. That was certainly an unexpected, uh, an unexpected way to end the night. And I guess maybe that's when it happens, right? When you least expect an Otani to happen, an Otani will happen. So that's crazy. Initially, I saw it and I and, and I kind of glanced at it, and I started seeing the, you know, the material autograph guarantee right there, and I was like, "Is that for reals?" And I th thought originally it was just going to be for the material, and then I saw the autograph, and then there it is. All right. Um, let's do a couple random. You know what? I'm going to make an executive decision. Boombox and EA. We'll send one to the Angels. We'll send one to the Yankees. How about that? And then we'll randomize this one. But we'll randomize the Trout and the Mantle. None of these are numbered, so it's not really... Um, Three times, one and a two. Name on top, one, two, and three. That goes to the Angels. That'll go to EA. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. What a great way to end the night. Great way to end the Friday. we got one more night tomorrow. I don't know what we're going to break because we sold out of a lot of things today. 
I'm sure we'll figure something out. Thanks, everybody. Joe for jazbeeshobbythat.com. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye.